Well, it seems like it's time for our weekly segment, The Stupid Fucking Thing Kyrie Said. Bi-weekly, we're on every two weeks. Well, the weeks we're not on, I ran about Kyrie to the homeless guy that lives outside the Barclays Center. This time, Kyrie threw teammates under the bus after a loss, saying it's pretty glaring we need one or two more pieces. He referenced Dinwiddie, Lavert, DeAndre Jordan, and Garrett Temple was the guys to build around. In response, the entire basketball world said, yeah, dumbass, the missing piece is KD. Yeah, it was crazy when Kyrie said the world was flat, but you know when he's really lost it, when he says Garrett Temple was part of the Nets' core. In that game, Kyrie went 6 for 21, scoring 14 points, and then blamed the role players for the loss. That's like murdering people, and then blaming it on the NFL for giving you CTE. It's not new that Kyrie is crazy. Normally, though, his game evens it out. On the talent crazy scale, he sits up there comfortably above the Meta World Peace line. The problem is while Kyrie has barely played this season, he continues to run his mouth and piss off teammates and fans. Reed, do you think the Warriors would consider trading D'Angelo Russell for Kyrie? Ha ha. Yeah, I bet D'Lo would be great for Brooklyn, but for as much drama that surrounds the Nets, it pales in comparison to the constant 30-year shit show that has been the New York Knicks. So, for all you tortured Knicks fans out there, we made a how-to video to make watching your team just a little bit easier. Let's call a rim check.